Why are you considering the time? Why do you want to upload the video only when most people are busy on the internet? The reason is because there is a tendency that everybody that is on the internet would be able to see your video. Because, for example, if you upload a video, or let's say, if you upload your own video, probably, let's say, at midnight in Cameroon, not so, that nobody is up at that time. It is possible that at midnight, the greater proportion of the population, they are sleeping. So nobody, maybe some people will not be available on YouTube to watch your video. So always target as now, as of now. Those of you starting, you people starting as of now. You will not be able to see anything. Probably maybe before you arrive 1000 subscribers and maybe around 1000 watch hours. That is when you will be able to see in your YouTube studio what time people are watching your video where the people are watching your video from and who and who is watching your video all these things will appear in your youtube studio when you are maybe when you are like five months into this youtube okay now remember i said when you upload a video that is where the real work begins when you start uploading videos that is where the real work begins why do i say this is where the real work begins i am saying the real work begins only when you start uploading videos because you have to first of all verify who is on. Who is on. So that when you upload your video, they can watch it. Alright? That is another work. Secondly, you need to push your videos. You need to push your videos till they reach the president of the united states if possible what do i say what did i say i said you need to push your videos till they reach the presidency of the united states of america do you know why you need to do this because you are a news youtuber it is very difficult for a new YouTuber, someone who is starting new, to gain exposure on YouTube. Especially when the person is not, when the person is not consistent. Consistency, I repeat, consistency, I repeat again, consistency is very, very, very important on YouTube 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 likes people that will bring more content to their platform and of course bring more money to their bank account what did I say I said that YouTube likes people that will bring more viewers to their platform and bring more money into their bank account how does this work because you already know advertisers will pay youtube for youtube to put their ads their advertisements on your videos when youtube collects this these advertisements from advertisers the advertisers pay the youtubers the, you, the youtubers make money why youtube makes money 
so for youtube to put those ads on your videos you have to be very very serious so that they can be pushing your content far let me explain something to you people before all my arrows on my watch hours my subscribers my views were all up my arrows were showing up then when i traveled for four days i did not upload any video for four days then all my arrows went back down and that is a very big disadvantage disadvantage for my channel because right now as i speak to you people the visibility that i used to get i am not getting it now because of what i did not upload videos for four days that is something youtube don't like when you are when you are already consistent remember i said youtube is not controlled by somebody who went there who just sat down there and was touching the machine youtube is controlled by a group of robots that have been set or put in place so as soon as they don't recognize what you are doing again they take the baton from your hand and give to another person who is doing the job right you understand so as soon as you don't you fail to upload videos if you start uploading videos and at the end of the day you don't upload again let's assume that you guys already know that i upload videos every day you guys are aware right yes that is because i am already monetized that is because i want to make money that is because i want to maintain my visibility on youtube that is because i want to tell youtube that i am present every day i will give them a video every day so that they can see that my channel is a serious channel always bringing people always bringing content and of course it will equally help them to make money it will help me to make money and of course bring more people to their tv channel because youtube is trying to bring a lot of people to watch their platform more than cnn bbc and whatever that is it remember i said for you to make money on youtube the length of the video is very important that was where i stopped and i told you people the length you should be using again the age of the viewer the age of the viewer matters a lot when you make money the age of the viewer matters a lot when you make money now i want to talk about just this age of the viewer then i talk about the things you need to be doing when you upload a video so that you can start doing it tomorrow as you upload your first video because the class of tomorrow i want to see at least one video from everybody so that i can be using those videos for reference now the age of the viewer is a second factor that plays a very important role for you to make money on youtube for example older people remember when you are monetized right youtube will be putting ads called things called ads advert uh, advertisement on your videos and remember that these advertisements come from advertisers what why are the advertisers bringing their advertisements to youtube they want the world to see their products they want YouTube to show their products to a lot of people around the world. Therefore, 
the more people click on your ads, the more older people click and watch your video, the tendency is that the more money you will make from that video. Another factor is that another factor is that the age okay I talked about the age let me now talk about the geographic location the geographic location of the viewer matters a lot I am explaining this and I shall explain again in our subsequent classes so that as we are doing we should know what we put on YouTube the geographic location matters a lot for example someone watching your video in Cameroon please listen to me carefully someone watching your video in Cameroon only helps you gain watch hours you don't make money someone watching your video from Cameroon only helps you gain watch hours and you don't make any money you know why you don't make money because because of probably the content or because of where the people are watching from as like i already told you guys that someone in cameroon watch your videos you don't make money but it helps your channel to grow because you generate watch hours now the reason you are not making money here is because advertisers don't pay for ads in cameroon advertisers do not pay for ads in cameroon therefore when you are already eligible for monetization you would have to go to your youtube studio and locate where it is written location you would have to go to your youtube studio and locate where your location is when you go to your location because your mobile phone is showing cameroon or uae the person in uae can mon can monetize without changing the location because uae is one of the countries one of the countries available in monetization but the person in cameroon will not be able to monetize except he changes his location you get it and when you go to the studio app the studio app you are going to change your location from there you can change it to nigeria you can change it to uk you can change it to america mine is united states it doesn't affect the channel another thing that would help you make money or not on youtube is the length of the video like I already explained to you people now how does the length of the video helps you make money when you are about to be monetized there are four different types of arts of arts that YouTube will give you the option to put on your videos when you are monetized one is the display arts one is the skippable ads another one is uh, the non-skippable ads the other one um, i have forgotten the name the skippable ads are the advertisements that you often see on facebook you may be watching a video like that and you reach a certain point you see something skip in like they are advertising something that those are the type of arts that are called skippable arts now for the person to make money or more money from the viewer watching his video with the art inside 
the viewer has to watch that art or allow the art to play. If the viewer skips the art, that is to say if the art jump into the video, right? And the viewer skip the art, the person watching your video skip the art, you will not make any money. But there is a certain small concentration, very small, that YouTube gives everybody that uh, let me say that youtube give everybody who skipped or let me say youtube pay you for the people who skip your art you get it yes okay now let me talk about another thing i have talked about the length of the video i have talked about the geographic location Okay, the last thing that is remaining that you need to know the type of content the type of content the content that you produce right? Guys, pay attention to it, to this video pay attention to this section the content the videos that you make will determine how much you make on YouTube People that make videos that are related to financial aspects, people that make videos on cryptocurrencies, people that make videos on bitcoins, people that make videos related to banking, people that make videos related to medical uh, insurance, people that make videos related to anything that has to do with finance, those people, their channels generate more money. I will come to that towards the extreme end of our lessons. Maybe in the upper weeks, I shall explain more to you. Those people who make content on financial aspects, financial channels, they make a lot of money. Financial channels make a lot of money. People that make gossip videos, like gossip vloggers, their channel makes little money compared to people that make videos about finance. People that make content related to my channel, like educational content, right? If you are able to teach people, not just to gossip, you would make money somehow behind the people that deals with financial channels for example there is something called cpn cpn is simply how valuable is your video so sometimes the cpn of a youtube channel increases all right and remember i said people who deals with financial videos bitcoins cryptocurrencies their channels have very high CPNs.